Hello there, welcome or welcome back. My name is Julie and this is my journal and I just wanted to update you on a couple of things. I have um, been to the gynecologist. It was a different one than did my surgery this summer. I just felt like I needed a fresh pair of eyes and a better bedside manner. So um, the same practice, just a different provider there. And I really appreciated him. I thought he was wonderful and his nurses were fabulous. So uh, I went in yesterday. Was it yesterday? God, the days are flying by. I believe it was yesterday. And did we figure everything out right away? No. But also, did we schedule surgery? No. So that's great. I did have to do, unfortunately, a nasty exam. Haven't had to do one of those since I had my partial hysterectomy, well, like five or six years ago. And then I also have had well, this surgery this last summer was taking everything else out. So the ovaries and all that, and then endometriosis and scar tissue. So the worry that, that I have is that either some of the endometriosis was missed or that some has grown back, which would be really unlikely in just a six, seventh month span, but could happen, you know, and if it's weird, it happens to me and with my body. So anyway, we had to do a nasty exam. Everything looked good down there, I guess. So that's, that's something to celebrate. And I'm, I'm grateful for that. We did talk about a lot of different things. And it was just kind of like, I don't know, I don't know, until I remembered to include one kind of random symptom that I was dealing with. And then realized it started around the same time as this just immense pain, and the bleeding and the cramps and the all of this, the bowel problems, you know, the digestive symptoms and, and just the pain, oh, the pain, started at the same time. And I had not put the two together. I hadn't figured on the correlation. And we still don't know if there is 100% a correlation, but the symptom was extreme severe jaw pain. And I had figured based on the rest of my body and other things that were going on that it was, oh, it's the RA out of remission, or it's or a flare-up of that, or it's blah, blah, blah. But the gynecologist put the things together, and his theory for the moment is a virus. So that maybe it is some kind of virus that, you know, especially because this came on all of a sudden, and the two things at the same time. So here's hoping that that's what it is. So um, he gave me several different suggestions, things to do to be on the bland brat diet to give my stomach, my guts, all of that a rest. Um, and already day one, I, I feel like that that's helping. Also to take stuff that you would take if you had a virus, your vitamin D, your zinc, you know, stuff like that. So I'm doing that. I'm taking my B vitamins. I'm taking echinacea. I'm also starting again on probiotics. I already had them here. I just hadn't been taking them, which is silly. So I'm doing that again. And the plan is we will wait two weeks and the appointment's already set up, which is great because he gets booked way out. I was only able to get this appointment yesterday by just a crazy fluke. And I'm so grateful for that. But anyhow, I went ahead and set up that appointment. I have to go to a different location. They had to squeeze me in. Yeah, <laughs> I don't know how I got that appointment yesterday, but I'm so glad. Anyway, I hopefully will be able to cancel that appointment in two weeks and someone else will get a much needed appointment. That's our hope is that, yeah, this was a virus. It you know, goes through its course because the pain in my jaw has eased up so much, especially in the last several days. But of course, then my guts, it was this crescendo building up until yesterday was the absolute worst day. It was like pre-surgery and, you know, crazy making, just, ah, dark thoughts, dark places. Today, it has been like a fifth we can get into some fractions and percentages here, like a fifth of what it was yesterday. And I had to have a talk with myself about how this doesn't mean we're all better. Don't go deciding that, oh, we're all better now. Everything's da 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 Wait, because if I don't, if I'm like, oh, yep, we're all better. And then tomorrow it's raging again, then it'll be the end of the world. So 
Today was better and that's awesome. And I will continue taking the supplements that the gynecologist uh, suggested and stick with the brat bland diet and um, just kind of see how it goes. And over the next several days, it'll, it'll do one or the other, you know, either it'll, you know, just keep easing up and getting better or it'll do what it do. Okay. And, and either way, we at least have a plan. And it was so helpful that A, we didn't right away schedule another surgery to go in and double check because I, I am not up to that. And B, that I was given a time frame because either way, if, if in two weeks, it's a mess, then yeah, we have to have surgery again. Okay, I know. Let's not even think about that as a possibility. Let's just think about the two weeks part of it because that's all I can handle right now is that in two weeks, like I just, if the pain goes back to what it was yesterday, I only have to handle it for two weeks and then we would be scheduling surgery anyway. Okay, so, uh, and maybe it'll be all better by then. I don't, I don't know. I don't know, but it's nice having an end date, you know? So no, I could absolutely not handle this for the rest of my life or be doing this every six months for the rest of my life. I could not stay in this pain and stay alive for, you know, 20 more years. Absolutely not. But two weeks, I can do two weeks. And especially because it eased up today. So <laughs> anyway, all right, that's what I've got. We have, we are so busy. We have so much going on. Reagan had the orthodontist yesterday. Then, um, and we had, what else did we have? Mariah's Valentine's party and I don't know, la 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 stuff. Oh, and then my doctor appointment. And then today, uh, Reagan had another follow up with his foot. And so we had that. And then tonight we've got like band instrument tryout stuff. So I've got to go. But that, uh, that's been my journal. I've been Julie. You've been wonderful. Thank you so much. And I will see you all very soon.